What is up, everyone? So last night was a little bit rough. Um, and today there's only a four-game slate. So uh, there's not a whole lot of um, superstar power um, on this one. Um, and there's not a lot of, like, good big sleepers either. Uh, so we're going to go back to the well here, and shooting guard, we're going to plug in Diallo and get his 20 plus points. Should be um, not highly owned. Uh, I don't think he was the last time. And um, we're going to go, I haven't played him in a while, but Olenek against the Suns. Suns are bad against big guys, and he's getting minutes. Kind of, but he's very efficient with his minutes. At 4,200, if over 24, I think it would be fine. 20 to 24. If it goes back to 30, that's awesome. It will be ahead of the curve. Um, yeah, um, also, let's do some dart throws here. <laughs> We're going to... Uh, I think I'm going to play Rodney Hood tonight. I don't expect much. I don't expect a lot of people playing him. Um, he's got two 30-point games. So it's like a 25% chance. Um, even if he hits 16 to 18 points, I'm okay with that. Um, given his prize point. Um, let's go up a little bit. I think Zubac has a chance to play more than 10 minutes. <laughs> um, I upgraded I had him at center but I went I had an extra 1300 left over which never happened so I replaced Zubac with uh, Steven Adams but yeah I think Zubac could hit 25 27 points tonight he should be in there because Whiteside is playing on the other side and um the only way he doesn't play a lot is if the other teams don't have a true center, which isn't the case. I'm just scrolling up. Um, yeah, let's go back down. I think there was one or two more. Oh, okay. Uh, no one's going to play this guy. I don't I don't think I know who this guy is or where he went to college. I got to do more research on him. I probably won't play him tonight, but he's a good dart throw if you need the salary, the salary relief. Um, it looks like he's playing minutes in, like, he's like a Ronnie Hood type play, although he doesn't have that big of a ceiling yet, but he's a scorer. He takes a few shots, but he's a guard that doesn't really offer much. He's kind of like the Wesley Matthews, if Wesley Matthews played about 15 minutes a game. And, uh, oh, I think Carson Edwards... If I don't even know what the spread is in this game is, but if this game gets out of hand early, Carson Edwards gets a lot of playing time. And 20 points is almost 7x. So he's a good person to take a look at. Um, I feel like everyone's talking about Kemba Walker or everyone's talking about fading Kemba Walker. I'm playing him. Um, not really because he's playing Charlotte, just because there's not a lot of expensive plays superstars to play but I think if you look on the other side and you want this game to stay close Scary Terry is having a heck of a season so far and I think not a lot of people will play him because I mean people oops including myself um, let's move this down We'll play Shea. I had Shea Alexander initially. Or they'll go with Rubio. Or Chris Paul. Or or Devontae Graham over him. Because it's cheaper. Or pay up for Devin Booker. Or Dame. So I feel like Scary Terry is in the middle of it all. And he'll get overlooked. And if he goes 40 to 50 points. You know, that's... That's a good start for the night. Anyways, um, that's going to do it. Not a whole lot of sleepers t today. 
Uh, but thank you so much for watching anyways, and for subscribing, for liking, for commenting, and let's win some money tonight.